Hey everyone, Eagle 3 here with just a quick update related to my Carrier Strike Group Part 2 tutorial. That video is linked below in the description for reference. In that video, I'd pointed out that the foul lines on carriers were not included in the carrier layout display in the mission editor. This created a challenge when placing static objects on the flight deck, especially parked aircraft. Without them, it can be difficult to avoid crossing the red and yellow stripe lines. And why is that important? Often when you see something painted red in the Navy, it means it's painted in blood from injuries. If an object or you are on the wrong side of that line, then there's a possibility that you or it will be on the receiving end of a rather violent collision. Included in the open beta patch released on May 27, 2022, under Supercarrier, was a fix for this issue, deck markings not visible in editor. As you can see now in the editor, the layout is the same as what you see in the mission. Additionally, you can see the outline markings for all recessed deck hatches. These can be flush deck power cables, bomb elevators, etc. You can also see flush deck pad eyes used with tie down chains to secure aircraft to the deck. Nice touch ED. This update isn't restricted to just the supercarrier ships. The heat blur provided USS Forrestal also includes markings in the mission editor view. However, the launch and recovery foul lines are white stripes and not the alternating red yellow. Regardless, they still serve the purpose. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, please consider leaving a like. Questions and comments are always appreciated. Until next time, Eagle 3 out.